Hi everybody, it's Mr. Kerbal. It is the Head Teacher Message Assembly. It is the first one of 2021, the week commencing 11th of January 2021. I hope your teachers will put this on Google Classroom and you can comment in the thread on Google Classroom. So first question I'm going to say is, people sometimes ask me why, I'm, why am I a head teacher? And I often think about it because I didn't plan to be a head teacher. That was not on my agenda at all. I had all sorts of other things that I was interested in and really wanted to be, but I landed up being a head teacher and I realize now it's one of the greatest gifts I've been given by the universe. And that's because being a head teacher allows me to help people to really become good at learning and to continuously be learning so that as as they learn, they keep on improving, keep on getting better and better. And that's what I believe life is all about, becoming your best. You never get to being your best. You keep on improving. Every time you learn something, you can grow from that and you can become even better. And that's why I came up with the CC way, which is all about character strength, all about continuously looking out for yourself, which is the confidence part, and wanting to use all your skills and talents and ability and just your contributions to making the world a better place, to being considerate and having consideration. And I went back to something um, at university, I studied psychology, and when I was studying psychology, I came across this concept of character strength. And I use a website called viacharacter.org, V-I-A character.org. And in that website, lots and lots of amazing research, and they break down character strength into six virtues and 24 character strengths. Try to remember those numbers. Six virtues, 24 character strengths. The virtues are good things, but they are big things. And each one of those virtues is broken down into further character strengths. And I want to today concentrate on the virtue of courage, which is living your life beyond fear. So we all get scared, but the point is, do we allow that fear to stop us and hold us back? Or do we live our life to the full? And in courage, which we've spoken about before, the first thing is bravery. So often we have a task to do. We've got something that we need to do, but we're a little bit scared. Maybe we're scared that we will make a mistake, that we won't get it right. Maybe we're a bit scared that we'll embarrass ourselves. Maybe we're worried about what people will think. But the point is to be brave and to say, I have got a task to do. I've got a challenge to face up to. I'm going to be brave. I'm going to go for it. The next character strength, which we learned in the virtue of courage, was honesty. Because sometimes we tackle the task we make a mistake. We all make mistakes. The secret is to be honest and say, I made a mistake. Let me try and learn from it. Let me try and fix it up. Let me try and improve and grow from that mistake. And that's called honesty. That's the virtue of honesty. And then the thing is, sometimes when we make a mistake, we all just want to give up. But if you keep going, if you persevere, that's the next character strength. That's perseverance. I was brave enough to start I hit an, uh, I hit an obstacle, made a mistake, but I learned from it. I was honest and I learned from it. And then I persevered, I carried on. Now today's character strength is to do with this and this. So you're looking at this and you're thinking, what on earth is this? Well, this one we know is a lemon. This is, well, I think people call it a lemon zester because people use it to scrape and grate the lemon skin and that drops into the food that you're preparing and it gives it a wonderful flavor. So the word zest, often people think of food and lemon zest and they think of flavor. But the, the character strength of zest is to commit to enjoying your life, to living life to the full. Now often we think to ourselves, I'm just bored or I, I'm just not interested. The point to remember is you are the boss of yourself. So if you say to yourself, okay, I'm bored, so what? What am I going to do? I am going to live my life with the zest. I'm going to enjoy myself. If I enjoy reading, if I enjoy exercising, if I enjoy learning, I am going to find something that I enjoy and I'm going, or even more importantly, I'm going to find a way to enjoy what I need to do. So I am going to find a way to live my life with the zest. So that is the character strength for the week. 
go for it. You can comment in the Google Classroom thread that your teacher has embedded.